This is Patita Logic. Tiny lessons, big brain energy. Welcome to Patita Logic, where we learn Python the way your brain likes it. Have you ever added up groceries in your head or split a dinner bill with your friends? That's all math your brain does automatically. Python just needs you to write it out with symbols. Let's take a look at some examples. Here we can say A equals two plus three. When we run this, we're going to see that the answer here will be five. The operation is the plus sign. You'll notice we're saving the results in a variable. If you're not sure about variables, check out our last video where we go over variables. There are multiple operations that you will see in Python, just like you saw in math. Some of the most common you'll see are addition, like the one we just did, subtraction, multiplication, division, and we'll even take a look at one more called modulus. Here, we're gonna use the subtraction operator. So let's say that we have $10 and we're gonna spend $4 on some snacks. We know that we'll only have $6 left, but the whole goal here is just to look at the operation and help us understand how we use operations in Python. You might think, well, this is pretty simple, but think about how you can use this in an app to make things a lot simpler. Every time you purchase something, if it has the same price, you can use a very simple operation in Python. Here, we're gonna take a look at the multiplication operation. We use an asterisk when we want to multiply two digits. Um, so here we're doing three times two, which gives us six. And that is a simple way to multiply in Python. Now let's look at division. We use the forward slash when we want to divide two numbers. So here, let's divide 12 by three, and of course we get four. Use a forward slash if you wanna divide. Let's take a look at modulus. Let's say you have seven cookies and three friends. You give each two cookies, but you have one left over. In Python, seven modulus three gives you one. That's like saying you have one cookie left over after sharing evenly. Now I hope you can try different operations in Python. Make it complicated as you want, make it as simple as you want, just have fun. In the next one, we're gonna go over if statements with operations. This is where the fun will really start. From one curious brain to another, see you next time on Patita Logic.